There was added security today in court. Family members for Officer Daniel Ellis and Raleigh Sizemore were on hand. Sizemore entered the courtroom wearing a bulletproof vest. Judge William Klaus emphasized that he wants the case to be transparent for the community. He also reinforced to the defense the importance to keep everything moving along to ensure the trial takes place when scheduled. Both sides discussed the possibility of filing motions to have the venue for the trial changed. Now, Gregory Ratliff was also in court today. He's accused of leading Officer Ellis into the ambush at a Richmond home where police say Sizemore shot and killed him. Judge Klaus denied a motion, saying Ratliff is still eligible for the death penalty. We're disappointed. If the police believed him, they would not have gone into the apartment with guns drawn. They would have turned around and gone home. Uh, and they did not do so. They did not rely on Mr. Ratliff's statement, and therefore we don't believe that he is responsible for Officer Ellis's death. I spoke with Eric Ellis, Daniel's brother, following today's hearing. He told me he just keeps playing everything over and over in his head as that one year anniversary approaches of his brother's death. He says he's just ready for the trial to begin. That trial date is set for July 5th, 2017. In Richmond, Michelle Chamberlain, WKYT.